A shot at the WWE title is at stake when Cena and Punk square off on Raw. Hi, I'm a tax lug. Uh, this is my continuing let's play of the 2K showcase mode. Going to hit the X button. Alright, it is time for Monday Night Raw. CM Punk vs. John Cena for the right to fight the WWE Undisputed Champion at Night of Champions. I just said that. Um, and I guess having turned off the music, uh, the music remains turned off unless it is some kind of a cutscene that demands the music. That's kind of a weird distinction to have in your video game, but who am I to say I don't program video games? I just talk over them on YouTube. Um, but letting these int entrances happen because obviously we get a bit, a bit more uh, of the background story from Michael Cole and Jerry Lawler. And I'm wondering, uh, perhaps this year, cons con considering how long we've had the three-man commentary booth at this point, will this year finally have a three-man commentary booth uh, in the video game? Because that hasn't happened yet. And uh, certainly... It would be strange considering that Lawler no longer works Raw, he works, he works SmackDown now, so having Cole and Lawler on your Raw broadcast uh, in the game would seem unusual. But I guess the question is, can you get Booker T and JBL, what is their schedule, you know, and that kind of thing as far as uh, recording a bunch of video game dialogue. Um, but I think it would be a shame if we don't get video game Booker T going, oh shucky ducky, quack quack, here we go. So, we're gonna let this continue to play out while I sit here and uh, somewhat read recent emails. But, nothing terribly important on, on the email front. Uh, getting some more backstory from uh, Mitchell Cole here. As Chris Jericho used to call him. And my phone needs to stop buzzing because it is getting. I need to turn that off. When I sit here and record these videos, it is rude. I know. Uh, but as someone who lives in the 21st century at this point, it is hard to ignore uh, even when you are recording videos for the internet. Alright, en en enough John Cena blowing on his uh, dog tags. We're gonna... I, I think I'm... Yeah, alright. So I am John Cena this time, and my goal here is to be John Cena, which is to win the match. Uh, to triumph over adversity, to overcome the odds, to be full of hustle, loyalty, and respect, to have five moves of doom, and the only thing that I sell is merchandise. And I don't let down for anybody. So let us move on to Night of Champions. Perplexing, like perplexing pixels. Yeah. Push you down, and then do the unusual John Cena drop kick, which is not something that he does very often. Yeah, the game denies involvement. Who texted Kevin Nash? And then we're gonna have that. Kevin Nash Triple H match, which is going to be weird. Who sent the text, you guys? Who sent? That's the stupidest storyline. I mean, it, for being a 2011 like storyline, I guess it's okay, but like, just the whole who sent the text thing is just the dumbest thing. Like, Personally, I'm fine with wrestling being dumb, but there's certain ways to be dumb, and that was not the good kind of dumb, it was the bad kind of dumb. Like, I want, like, thing, things like Chris Jericho spilling his hot coffee on Kane and, and that causing a match. That, to me, is a more acceptable kind of dumb in terms of wrestling feuds, but who sent the text message? I don't know, just... Perhaps, I, perhaps I'm an old man at this point, and it doesn't really matter, but, uh... Here we go. Nope. Elbows to the jaw. And 
Ah, stop, he's already dead. Can I, am I allowed to kick, kick out here? Yes. I was gonna say, I hope so. Look, I'm barely, I'm barely fatigued here. So don't, don't worry about me, I'm gonna keep doing my, my big dumb clotheslines. Oh crap. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, nope. Nope, nope. Nope. Why is Del... When was Del Rio ringside? Like, I just... The first time I'm, I'm noticing that. They didn't have him, you know, have his own little entrance to come down. I guess it was during the commercial break. Um... But... Weird. John Morrison? John Morrison! What the f... Were they supposed to say John Morrison? Is that... Is that in the... In the script there? It's a weird guy to just... Bring up all of a sudden. Like, at what point did he leave the company? It's, it's been... It's been a while. Since we have seen... Mr. 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 Nitro. Oh, come on. That's crap. That's crap. I wanted to do my five knuckle shuffle. Do your stupid screw you, CM Punk. Oh, referee bot! Oh, you can't pin me now. Wait, he's not counting. Weird. Weird. Ref bump. Oh, slap to the face. That's just disrespectful. Disrespectful, Mr. Punk. Miss Mr. Brooks. Now, we can have the proper five-knuckle shuffle get into position as I do my dumb hand jive thing. Now I gotta get my stamina back here. Alright. Get up, CM Punk. Now, get your attitude adjusted or... You know, I'd like it to be, but... So this is how they make it so if you're gonna lose... Like, I don't remember what happened in this match, honestly. My, my memory is not that great. Um... I don't remember the actual... Like, outside of the big picture points, you know, like, the pipe bomb... And that weird Nash Triple H match that happened. Uh, the specifics of, of this feud. Uh... Once it... Once it... Once they started... Oh, yeah. Kevin Nash. So stupid. So stupid. Are they gonna have him do that thing where he was like hitting? He 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 hit tr Triple H backstage with the sledgehammer, and he had made that dumb face when he when he did it. John Cena sucks. John Cena sucks. See, so they'll play the music in the cutscene, uh, but when you have music disabled. During a regular entrance, they will disable the music. Brutal beatdown. That it is. But, like, I don't want to see Del Rio versus Cena. I don't want to play Del Rio versus Cena, but that's how it happened historically, so we don't have much of a choice now, do we? Um, and he's just going to keep on beating. Yeah, here comes People Power! John Lord Artis! Johnny Ace. He's a cool dude. Where's your, where's, where's your skateboard, Johnny Ace? Where's, where's Shane Douglas? And this cutscene just continues. Uh, and I'm gonna assume what's gonna happen is they're gonna finish this in-game cutscene, and then it's gonna cut to actual video footage of what we just watched because uh, that makes. A lot of sense. Like, I don't mind having the, vid the video packages beforehand, but having them, um, right after of what you just saw is kind of weirdly jarring, considering the game doesn't really give you any kind of a real, like, it doesn't give you any kind of a real, ch like, chapter break. It just kind of rolls right into the next load screen, and, uh, kind of just, you know, I guess you're, you're supposed to play it all in a row, but, um, gonna have to blur this out.
Destiny was not a very good game. Needed more content. Um, that's just me. But this is a nice promo thing for Del Rio tapping out Mysterio, and neither of those guys are in the company anymore, which is really funny. Hey, there's Christian. Good for him. Yeah. Uh, this, this, Del Rio's title runs is not particularly enthralling. Uh, they wasted a lot of, there's, Del Rio is a hell of a wrestler, but, man, they waste, just, just, potential. And you can put that blame on creative, because you can put a, a, a lot of blame, uh, in the company on creative, because it is no longer just, you know, two guys, it is like 30 guys. Um, and a lot of them are just not very good at what they do or don't understand the ins and outs of wrestling, which is what happens when you hire guys who, you know, previously only worked on TV shows and not, didn't have a background in wrestling. Oh, hey, there's Ricardo Rodriguez, who doesn't also work, doesn't work there anymore, which is a shame, because Ricardo Rodriguez, extraordinarily talented, like, hell of a guy, um, and, uh, yeah. This this whole thing with Cena and, and, and Del Rio got kind of racist. Kind of, not, not, not totally racist, but just a little racist. Um, and that was weird. But, is this Raw or is this, oh, this is Night of Champions, but that, that graphic looked like it was Raw. So, oh, uh, Cena was only 9-time champion in 2011. He is now 15-time champion. Let that shit sink in for you a little bit. Man. That was like four years ago. Man. Alright, well. We're gonna stop here. Uh, and let the rest of this happen tomorrow. So we're gonna quit this match. Uh, I didn't get our little graphic here for the champions. And then see what we are currently at here. The Man of Destiny, Alberto Del Rio, uh, and that will be the backstabber there will be tomorrow's episode of this Let's Play of the 2K Showcase uh, for 2K15 on the PS4. As always, I am your host, Attack Slug. My voice is almost shot, but that's okay. Doing it for you, doing it for you guys, uh, and I will see you next time right here on this channel. And I'm out.